Yo, YouTube. I figure I'd do a little bit of behind the scenes of what's going on in my life. I see other guys doing it. I see Cali Muscle, he's all over LA with his camera and showing people what's going on. I don't even know what y'all wanna see. I don't even know what works anymore. I don't know anything about algorithms. I kinda live in a rock when it comes to doing this well. I'm gonna begin by being a little vulnerable with y'all, but like in a different way, just showing you my belly button. The reason why I'm showing you my belly button is because my belly button's like an inch deep. I'm fat right now. I've been doing a lot of reflecting. The truth is, if I'm gonna be like teaching again, I'm gonna be coaching again, I gotta leave from the front. Since tearing my Achilles tendon and both of my biceps a couple years ago, my body just has not really been the same. My posture is a mess. I got all kinds of muscular imbalances. Here I am trying to get back into a strongman show, but meanwhile, I'm buckling all over the place. I'm not in good shape. I think the only thing I really got going for me is flexibility because I stretch every single day. But the reason why I stretch is because I got so many damn injuries. I tell you what, if you guys want to watch me bounce back, because I know I can. Hold on. Fooey! Remy Boy Rita, let's go! My dog's running my dogs are gone. They see like a turkey or something. Yeah, just hang with me. Let me know what you think. Let me know what you want. Let me know how you roll and I'll roll with you, bro. I'll catch you on the inside. Let's go eat, yo. There you go, boy. They came back quick. Okay, cool. So I'm gonna break fast with you guys here today. If you've been following for a while, you know that this is my favorite meal. It's basically a version of the vertical diet. Mash, egg whites, I gotta go get it. Boom. Egg whites. So basically all I use is ground beef, egg whites, usually white rice, but today I'm using some brown rice that was hooked up by my mama, mama's rice. Boom. So we got ground beef. My wife prepares all this ahead of time. Five, six ounces of this, just heating it up, heating it up on my nonstick pan. You guys use nonstick pans? I would avoid nonstick pans, but my wife likes them. I don't mind because she the one that gotta clean them some. Some people don't use nonstick because they say it's toxic. It might be, do you believe that? I'm estimating, maybe it's all that estimating that still got my belly big, but that's about six ounces. One cup of rice. I usually almost always use white rice. This is the one my wife makes for me. This is what I normally eat. And one of her hairs is in here, look. She got long hair now. Y'all might remember she's got short hair. So that's what I usually use, but my mama was here this weekend. So I'm using my mama's rice. My mama make this rice and beans. So I just take a cup. I might use a nonstick pan, but one thing I don't use, microwave. Do you use a microwave? Who uses a microwave? I haven't used a microwave in decades. I know when I go to the supermarket, they probably put my food in the microwave. Well, I'll be caught dead before I put anything in the microwave. I sit on it to heat it up. I will fart on it to make it warm before I put it in a damn microwave. The crazy thing is, I never bought a microwave before. I never bought a microwave in my life. Never purchased a microwave. Every house I come to got a damn microwave in it. And I know it's not like that everywhere. You guys in Europe, let me know. You probably don't have microwaves automatically installed in every house that you go to. Is that it? I haven't really been tracking my macros much, but this being my first meal, probably get to 3,000 calories today. So we'll just let that heat up. Oh, it's all starting to come together now. Some good stuff right there. It's a bunch of protein, it's a bunch of carbs. It's not that much fat. One thing I discovered, I, when I was my leanest, and when I'm usually my leanest, I'm not eating any carbs at all. Carnivore, keto, but um, I don't wanna do that no more. I also like the way I feel when I have when I have carbs. Also, I'm not on TRT. I know these guys who are doing um, keto and all that, like they're on TRT, so their hormones are stabilized. If I don't eat carbs for too long, I feel like my T levels drop. I don't know for sure, because I haven't had it tested in a while. Maybe that'll be one of the things. Maybe I'll make a video with that. My carbs aren't that high. I do 50 to 60% protein, about 25% carbs, 25% fat. If I eat more than that, well, I'll, I'll be much fatter. I'll be a fat boy. If there was only one kind of food that I could eat for the rest of my life, it would probably be this. What's your favorite food? Oh, I know y'all gonna say it was fried chicken, right? Going black. Fried chicken and watermelon. All right, here we go. Moment of truth. So I eat all my meals out of this bowl right here. I do like fried chicken though. My mom makes fried chicken. She makes little fried chicken wings. Fries them up real good, crispy, crunchy. Dip it in some hot sauce. That's good stuff too. But I tell you what, the oils that it's cooked in make me feel terrible. So I don't eat much processed food. One thing that I eat that keeps me all puffy Sugar, and we don't really have too much sugar. It's not like candy and stuff like that. My wife buys like granola bars for the kids and I'll just be snacking on granola bars. Big old water jug. All right, hey, I'm a Southern gentleman. I take off my hat around the table. What y'all think about my new hairstyle, by the way? Everybody gonna be going to get that low taper fade, the Elliot Hulse fade. It comes out on the side like Larry. 
<laughs> you call me Larry. <laughs> right on the side, all bald in the middle and shit. Anyway, you know who loved me? Jesus. In the name of the Father, Son, Holy Spirit, amen. Bless us, Lord, and these are your gifts which we're about to receive from your bounty through Christ our Lord, amen. Oh man, some good stuff. Mmm, mmm. I've always resisted doing blogs and vlogs and shit like this. I don't even like talking to y'all while I'm working out. So they all interrupted my meal at a talk instead of chew. Chew or talk, which one? While we having a dinner time conversation, let me share something with you that I got going on that I think you guys might find fascinating. You know I've been here on YouTube since 2006, and I sold all kinds of stuff on YouTube. Football workout program, I sold my lean hybrid muscle workout program. I had something called Primal Edge, Advanced 5x5, Simple Strength Training Program, Muscle Virus Solution, I had Strengthology Program, all kinds of stuff. Bam, I've been making programs, workout programs for well over two decades. Buy stock, I'm done. I ain't even got shit no more. Huh? I'm moving on, and I wanna give them all away to you for free. That's right. I will give you all of my old programs. Every single old program I ever made. But I want you to have them now. I want you to have all of them so that you can put them together and be the strongest version of yourself in every area of your life. If that sounds good, click the link in the comments or the description down below. And take a look at my King for Life program. That's right. You can be a king in your life for life with me, Elliot Halls, and I'll get you access to all of the programs as well as every new program I create moving forward from here on out. So I got something in the works for posture. I'm creating a new posture power program. It's going to be all the anatomy and physiology of posture, but also the application of the exercises that I'm using to correct my most severe muscular imbalances. You're going to want to see that. That's coming up here pretty soon. I'm doing a non-job 2.0 program. The non-job 2.0 program. Oh, I forgot about that too, nah, nah. It's about how to use AI, how to use AI to make money online. Then let's not forget bioenergetics, bioenergetics. Nobody's even really talking about that at all. I noticed that y'all don't wanna watch my videos about it. I get like a 3% click-through rate on those videos. But if you're one of the weirdos, wanna learn how to breathe into your balls, you gotta click that link, because that's where you're gonna find all my new stuff that's related to that. You get all my curated resources on the topics that I'm researching every month. I'm always researching something new. That's why people are always like, oh, how do you know so much stuff? Because I'm a little bit obsessed about things. I get like micro obsessions. All inside King for Life. But that's what it is. And you'll learn all that when you click the link down below. Enough talking. I got to concentrate and eat. I got to slow down and chew. 40 chews per bite. Allow the digestive enzymes in the mouth and the stomach through the parasympathetic nervous system to secrete after rest and digest. That means I'm done talking to y'all. Done.